Hello, my friends, and welcome back. It is Sunday, September 12th, 2021. I'm the Drunk Folk Root. His beer time. How you doing? It's like a gloomy day. It's a dark and stormy day. It's threatening rain, but it's not raining, so we're good there. Let's have a beer before we have to go inside in case it does open up. I gotta have at least one patio pint today from News Brewing, where we went the other week. Lovely place. You need to check it out. Comes extra Wakatu single hop pale ale, 5%. The Wakatu hop is from New Zealand. As we've talked about New Zealand hops this year, we love them. They've been fun. It's starting to rain. We're going to keep going, though. Let's get into this. I should want my book to get wet. I'm reading the new Stephen King book. It's actually pretty good. Uh, I dig what Muse is throwing down. Some tasty beers. Good times had by all we went there. I noticed a lot of people went in the coming weeks after we went, and I was really happy to see that because I think they're making some really exceptional beers there, and I think that needs to be said. This small producer's doing some really great stuff. Let's get into this. Cheers. It's starting to rain a little harder, but that's okay because I've got sunshine in my glass. Beautiful. So again, with these New Zealand hops, I find there is this earthy quality to them, this earthy floralness. Um, it just, it, it has this natural thing that I, I can't get out of my head. It's like walking through like a, a maple forest, you know, not a, not a, not a pine tree forest, the other kind of forest, a boreal forest. And, and I think this nice sprightly lemon lime flavors, a nice bit of citrus. And then you've got a bit of from their, their house yeast, which tends to lend a little belgian to it. Um, you get a bit of spiciness in the back too, like a, a hop spiciness or yeast spiciness. And that's nice. That That is certainly something that makes for an interesting beer and also a refreshing beer. And it's not your everyday pale ale. It's a nice expression of the hop, but the base beer is also very good. And I'd be interested to see other hops as they do this series. They're going to do the series of different hops it would be interesting to explore them because the base beer is really, really good. And you change up the hops and you're going to get a little bit of a different beer and you really get to explore what they taste like. So, yeah, there you go. Hit up Muse. I know we're going back uh, when the leaves start to change color a little more because uh, it's a spectacular place to sit outside and have a beer. They have a fire pit. They have a fire pit, too. So you can go, like, you know, and sit around the fire pit. If there's a little chill in there, you wear a sweater, you grab a couple beers, sit around the fire pit, have a good time. That's Sunday, my friends. Let's get after it. You know, back to work tomorrow. Oh. Bees. And dogs. And dogs, when they bark, they shoot bees at you. Uh, anyways, uh, guys, have a great night. We'll talk to you later. Cheers. You know, there's that saying, always. I always think of that saying when I, whenever it starts to rain and I'm outside and people run for cover. And I was like, ain't sugar, won't melt.